If you have a video jet, it almost looks like the same core, except for when it's time for a PM, you have to buy and change out this whole core. Ours, when you do a PM, we have, and this is another point that I always point out, we have our filter on the outside. All of our valves are under here, so we don't have to break apart anything. All of our valves are replaceable, they're at the top. Our filter is here in the back. We have our main ink pump on the back here. And then the, one of the things that is unique to us is we have something called a gutter pump. And why this is so important in you is any machine out there right now that needs to pull vacuum for the gutter uses what's called a venturi. So this venturi, usually it's like, almost looks like a cross shape if you were to look in the inside. So there's two little holes on the sides and there's holes on the top and bottom. What'll happen is as the uh, ink goes through, it creates a vacuum on the outside on the other two holes and that's what pulls the vacuum to allow the ink to return from the gutter. The problem with that is, is those venturis can be prone to uh, clogging and what will happen is people will start losing gutter suction and then you have to basically take uh, whatever system it is apart, pull the venturi, clean the venturi out, try to get it completely clean. Um, some competitors don't use a stainless steel venturi, so after a certain amount of time, the material breaks down and it has to be replaced. So we have a venturi in here, but our venturi has nothing to do with our gutter suction. We have a gutter pump. So our gutter is completely, has its own pump. So as far as vacuum problems, you do not run into nearly half of the problems that regular systems do when they have to use a venturi to create the vacuum. So um, say like a Lynx printer is known for losing vacuum, and that's usually one of the, the first things is if you pull the venturi, you clean it, you put it back in there, you get your vacuum suction, but then you end up using it. So usually when you get around time that you're due for a PM, is when you'll start getting more sediments that kind of collected in the main ink filter and you'll have a customer that seems to run into a little bit more clogging they'll start complaining about it. it's been running perfect for a year now it's clogging a little more it's just because they're due for their people uh, so and this down here is what we call a wash pump so it has its own pump for washing the print head so the only part of this pump right here it's a diaphragm pump its only purpose is when you turn off the printer it flushes the print 